example. We saw the Nevada uh, Supreme Court decision the other day about that church. You can limit the size of people going to church, the amount of people going to church. Uh, there are many Americans, not just religious Americans, many Americans concerned about where this is going from a religious freedom standpoint as it relates specifically to COVID-19. Well, look, our, our nation has been through a very challenging time and we're still working our way through the coronavirus pandemic. Mm -hmm. But you don't give up your constitutional liberties, even in a pandemic. And that's why as we began to open up America again, President Donald Trump said, we gotta open up our churches. We gotta open up our places of worship. And we couldn't have been more disappointed to see a narrow Supreme Court decision that would say in the state of Nevada that casinos can be open at one size, but churches could, can, can be open at another. Mm -hmm. I mean, Justice Gorsuch put it well. He said, there's, there's, there's no universe in which Caesar's Palace should be treated differently than Calvary Chapel, but it was by the Supreme Court. And it's why for all the progress that we've made and for the more than 200 conservatives we've appointed to our courts at every level, uh, I think people that cherish religious liberty, mm -hmm. people that cherish our, our values and worldview know that we need, we need more conservatives on the Supreme Court of the United States. We need President Donald Trump back in the White House for four more years so that we can build a more durable conservative majority on the Supreme Court. And